were also born for a season. No man was born as a statistics. Even if you're a child of a single mother or a single father, I want to assure you the Bible has examples of men that defied the definitions of societies and became men of importance. Life is a neutral playground. Life is a neutral playground. And people succeed because of applying principles. And people succeed because of understanding principles. That is what brings successful men. I was in Dubai last week with my wife. And I told my wife, it's amazing. Dubai is becoming the biggest city in the world. They are in the last 20 years. In the last 20 years, Dubai has moved from becoming a desert to the biggest city globally. In, in less than a generation. Kenya, we have had our freedom for 60 years. But the level of growth that is in Dubai, you can't compare it to Kenya. They are now in the levels of New York and the levels of Europe. And when I was walking around, I found a book written by the Sheikh of Dubai and it was called The Power of Vision. Now, of course, those it's a Muslim nation. They are very serious with their religion. But when I looked at the success of Dubai, I realized other than being serious with religion, they are disciplined in vision. They, I told my wife, these guys don't speak in tongues. These guys, they don't have cashers. But they have results. Those are some of the reasons why you go to countries like China. You realize today China is becoming a global uh, economy. Because in China and Korea, one of the things that you cannot waste is time. A friend of mine is a doctor from Korea. He told me the worst thing that can happen to a student is to miss a lesson. Mtoto wa kitolewa darasa ambiwe, you won't attend this class. That child can commit suicide. China was the one that created TikTok. And the reason why they created TikTok is so that they can give a platform to young people so that they can show their innovations. So when a man is thinking of creating something, as they are developing it in a three minutes video, you release it on TikTok. But when TikTok was discovered in America, it became a tool of entertainment. And when TikTok came in Africa, it became a tool of time wastage. <laughs> and so when you go to China today, they control Facebook, they control TikTok, they control Telegram, the government controls what is being posted. And in Kenya, a statistics came out that young people spend eight hours on social media. So, if a young person sleeps for eight hours and spends eight hours on social media, by the time they are 24 years old, they will have spent 16 years sleeping and watching Facebook. That young man does not need prayer and deliverance. That young man is a failure on arrival. Nasio generational curses, 